Hello everybody and welcome back. We're playing some more Finding Paradise and where we last left off we are in the plane with uh, Colin's last flight and right now we are gonna go grab his family. His familia. Oh. Okay. Uh, the hat. Yes! Flight regulations are still so chill back in the day, huh? And times change. Okay. Back in the day, he's still old. So. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. How are you today? That's good. Very good. So, what do you do say? One last round? Is it alright with management? Already approved. Special occasion and all. You heard him, Ma. Go, go, go. Oh, hell yeah. Who the hell's that random ass person? Oh, well, I guess I can't talk to him. It's that bitch. What the hell? Why is he standing like that? So, you gonna miss the views? From the big birds? Sure. But it's not like I'm giving up the sky. Oh, don't you go renting those small planes. I don't trust you flying in them. Speaking of, I wish they gave you a bigger plane for the last flight of your career. Like one of those monster double-deckers. Ha! I asked for this one in particular myself. I had my first flight with the with the airline in this. It was a different time back then. A time with lots of peanuts. I miss them so much. You know, Dad. All these years of flying, you never told me why you choose to be a pilot in the first place. Oh, I haven't, huh? Psst. Don't tell your mother, but it was to impress a girl. Yeah? Did it work? Sure, I guess. Oh, please. With the way your father acted, I doubt he dated anyone at all when we met. Shots fired, Dad. Hey, now, Fia, don't go spreading false rumors in front of our son. I'll have you know, I was quite the stud back in the days. Captain, just a reminder that we're on the record for the black box. Oh, thanks for the reminder. Let the record show that my biceps are out of this world. No. No, they really aren't. Gee, thanks. She sounds like me. <laughs> oh, but they are. When I pulled that yoke on takeoff earlier, I practically lifted the entire plane off the ground. Isn't that right, Peyton? Yes, Captain. Yeah? Well, let me tell y'all a story about this one time involving a jar of pickles. Okay, we need to maintain the sterile cockpit for landing. Let's get you two back to your seats. Off you go now. Shoo, shoo. LOL. Sir, we're not landing for another couple of hours. Ah, oh, no. Sick. Okay. What exactly are you doing, sir? Okay, we're just gonna leave him there, I guess. So, uh, are you coming with me or what? No, I like this view. I thought you were acrophobic. Only when I'm not inside a plane. How about you go wrap up this memory and I'll join you shortly after. Are you serious? It's on a loop. Yeah, but the pic- I could be a little off, but here it is. This bitch thinks I was talking to her. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, but from this seat's angle, it's just absolutely divine. Oh, I just did old man voice. In fact, I pity you or anyone who can't see the way the horizon meets the... Don't give me that cabbage. Oh. Hello. Is this them getting off? Thank you for the lovely flight, sir. Cheers. I hope you have a nice day. 
Hello, little one. Hope you enjoyed the... The landing sucked! Uh, yeah, sorry. It was a little rough. Not one of my better landings. The wind was... Note received. Regret. Bad landing. Oh. Okay, so he wants a better landing on his... Last flight. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Oh. Guess everyone's gone. Oh, a fellow cellist, huh? Here, let me get that for you. Thank you, sir. Yay, are you good at the cello? Nah, not really. My wife is the real musician of the family. Beautiful instrument, though. I loved playing it as a kid. Note, cello. Let's read those notes. Okay. Colin loved playing the cello as a kid. The landing equipment of Colin's career... Oh, what the fuck? Why the hell did I say equipment? The last landing of Colin's career didn't quite hit the mark. Okay. So I guess back inside? Uh, okay. We need to figure out a memento, though. Who the hell is this person standing there? Oh, there it is. I should have figured that out. Alright, let's do this. Ow, I was sitting on my foot and now it's asleep and feels really weird. just do it without him so dude I was just about to okay sick sick nasty oh we are a kid again uh how do we skip to the childhood memories again and this time the memento isn't even that book there's something else wrong with the sheen, Neil. Is there something else wrong with the sheen, Neil? Okay, fuck, I can't talk. Huh? It's not the machine. At least, I don't think it is. Well, I guess at least we know that we can go back now. Let's just hope this doesn't interfere with finishing this job. Relax. We'll manage. Just chill, baby, chill. Is there literally anything else left, Miss Miller? Nope. This is your instrument. Get used to it. Oh, what a bitch. Is it just American kids, or did every kid have to play freaking the recorder in elementary school? That useless instrument that you'll never pick up again. Um, Dr. Watts loved playing cello as a kid. My ass. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Wow, you belong out of grade school. Your childish job jabs aside, Eva, on an unrelated note. This place kind of makes me feel like I'm on the set of some indie French film. Uh, what? What about this possibly makes you feel that way? I don't know. Just the feeling. Okie dokie. Dr. Watts is so fucking weird. Um... Okay, so we need to find some more mementos. I bet another one is the cello. He's had a lot of things that he's had throughout his life. If you wanted something else, you should have lined up earlier. Hmm, okay, it's not the cello. The piano or the... What the hell are those called again? Xylophone? I always loved playing those in elementary school, though. Those were fun to play. Hey, don't push! I call dibs on the violin. It's so light to carry. I'm gonna get the flute. It fits in my backpack. And there we come out with a cello. Oh, hell yeah. Do they make kids cellos or are they all just like the size of a grown man? <laughs> okay, so we, let's follow him and his cello. Oh, 
Okay, there are trees. This was in a bird story, so... Did you see that? Is he carrying that thing, or is it carrying him? Looks like it's just a floating case from behind. Fuck you guys. Look at the trees. It makes me want to replay a bird story. Okay, where the fuck are you going? You just got this thing. Where are you taking it? Hi. Goodbye. Uh. Okay. Oh, we gotta find another memory of him. Oh, there it is. I just walked past him. Oh, that kid's got a yo-yo. Wow, this is awkward to watch. Oh, sad. Eva, why do we get all these losers as our clients? Okay, he's like fucking like 10, if that. Like 8, eight or 7. Maybe because you're here, moron. You can't judge a 9-year-old as being a loser. Oh, well that's a nice compliment under Gus's law of magnetism. Excuse me? What the fuck did you just say to me? Are you talking to me? Can we go over here yet? Um, where the hell did he go? Maybe I should talk to this kid with the yo-yo. Maybe we liked that secretly. Okay, we didn't. Um, oh. Huh, I have a feeling these aren't exact replicas from the actual setting. It's as if this memory took quite a creative liberty in mixing things up. Oh, that was Watts that said that. Isn't the machine built with public domain data stabilizers to prevent this? Er, yeah, but maybe broken? Maybe? You're the tech specialist. Yeah, I'll have a look afterward. So, are we not allowed to come out of the machine until we're done? I feel like that would be counterproductive. Because what if something did happen? Uh, will we just be stuck in here? What's he doing? Counting dirt, I guess. Oh, okay. We can go in here. Beep, beep, beep. Miss Parker. Call in. Shut the fuck up, Miss Parker. Call in! Um, the answer is C. What? I'll ask you again. What is the radius of this circle? Okay, bitch. He's like nine years old and you're learning radius. Uh, where's your head at, Colin? Go stand in the, out in the hall. Okay, fucking bitch teacher. What the fuck? thing up here. I mean, what teacher throws you out in the hallway for not paying attention? Everybody has daydreamed. Hmm, that could be our ticket out of here. Uh, alright, I think if, I think we could reach it if we just, no, I got this. Let me find a way. Can I steal this, please? Can I steal? Go stand out in the hallway. How about this plant? Oh. Alright. Now watch this. Is that a freaking wand? Wait. You didn't disable the... Mobar... Mobilarius? Uh... Teacher's desk... Guess. Harry Potter, bippy. Any Harry Potter fans out there? I fucking love it. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! And... Down. I like how he remembers what she was wearing, but not her face. Did you kids just flip and see that? Dude. Reset! Okay, first of all, disable reactive interactivity before you pull that stuff. And second of all, that's not even how that spell goes. Uh, yeah it is. Did you see that thing fly? They sure did, you village idiot. You fucking idiot! Okay, hell yeah. 
Okay, if we can move the teacher's desk like that, why can't we just move the clock off the wall? That would be an even smarter question. Hmm. What? Nothing. I guess I was expecting you to start saying dumb things again. Eva, do you know how draining it is to unleash a Kamehameha and a Hadouken simultaneously? I mean, I know I'm a pro, but even I need my beauty sleep. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Just fucking prepare the memento, you dumb bitch. Hill to the year. Here we go. Sorry, I get thirsty talking this much. I don't know why. Because I don't get thirsty talking, like, person to person. I was actually just on the phone with my cousin for, like, 45 minutes and I didn't get thirsty. Uh, are we back at the old age period again? Old age. <laughs> well. Okay, they obviously just moving in. And here it is, the perfect retirement apartment. We sure are. Okay, so they are in a retirement home. Okay, I think I got it figured out. Hmm? I mean, we haven't just been jumping back and forth randomly, right? There's a pattern to it. We go old to young to old to young. With all of our other patients, we began for the most recent point and gradually traced backwards. And in this case, we did start like that. It did start like that. For the first few memories in his oldest time, everything went just as normal. But then, somehow, we got slingshotted. All the way back to the earliest accessible memory. So we cleared that and once again, leaped back. To the older times where we left off. Then, to the earlier ones again, moving forward. Okay, so something really dramatic happened in his midlife. And once more to the older times, moving backward. These jumps aren't in a random order, and nor do they form just any pattern. It's the pattern of a decaying orb. It's almost as if we're being pulled in, spiraling toward a gravitational center. Oh shit, bitch! I didn't even know memories could work like that. A gravitational center, huh? Inappropriate context for physics aside, what do you think is causing this? Some oh-so-deep event of melodramatic angst that traumatized our fine gentleman? I don't know. Maybe it is a memory of that sort, but that's what I said. Maybe it's something else. Uh, something else? What could be here other than memories? That fucking hoe who went into his office. Like I said, I don't know. It's just that we've seen a lot of patients and there's never been a memory that's done this. All right, I guess at least this one isn't routine then. Hmm, we'll see. Okay, so I'm assuming we get one from them. One bedroom with a balcony and there's also an attic for storage. How often do you find attics in an apartment, huh? Not to mention the lake view. I thought the lake was on the other side of the building, though. Yeah, but this unit is on the edge. You can see it if you hold out a mirror from the balcony. Okay, bitch. Here, have a brochure. Okay, this bitch needs to fuck off. I'm already done with him. And this is the kitchen. If you pay attention to the walls, you'll notice that it hasn't even had one fire accident. Of course, if it had, the whole place would have surely burnt down, being an apartment and all. Uh, I mean, of course it won't happen, because y'all seem like you're careful folks, right? I guess what I'm saying is, um, fire safety is very important. Okay, I don't like him. He's annoying me. Let me in, let me in. Okay. 
This place is weird, though. Should we go in here next? Is this where it would be? Or should we have went into the attic first? Um. Oh, okay, here they are. It's weird, though. Why is there this weird bedroom, like, off the bedroom? You said you're a musician, right? This room is perfect for performances. There's a very little room for an audience, though. You'd probably be playing alone. Which is kind of sad, but I digress. Okay, ho. Okay, now where to? Oh, hey, look, there's a door here. Oh, does that lead to the kitchen? For some reason, I always think this is upstairs. How the heck do you come upstairs right here, and then you don't go back downstairs, but you go into the kitchen? And as you can see, this is why they call this the Lakeview Residence. <clears throat> I mean, you can't literally see of it because the lake is behind us on the other side, but if you extend your head off the balcony to the left, you might be able to see a bit of it. Don't though. You'd fall off. Okay, on we go. This motherfucker, motherfucking bitch. Why is he just standing there? Does he not like this place? I mean, it's okay. So, what do you think? Well, it is nice and quiet. I like it. Me too, but... I would have liked it better if we... If you just didn't talk, Fred. Yeah, that one really didn't help. At all. If you weren't my cousin's friend's brother... We would have walked out by now. More like ran out. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm not good at sales. So, um, sorry to be blunt, but are you going to take it? Because there's a deposit fee, you see, which technically I could have loved with, but I promise I... Stop talking. We'll take it. Mm-hmm. There we go. Oh, look, a little airplane. Huh. Wasn't this just a brochure a moment ago? Oh, shit. I just realized my air turned on. I'm sorry. Eh... Uh, I guess he just folded it. What's the issue? Well, I'm guess if I'm guessing right. Oh, being a memento, it's kind of odd that it came to be without a sing. Huh. In any case, it, at least it's convenient. I didn't see another way out of this place. Fro shizzle, my nizzle. It's weird that they always have memory, or that. I guess it's not weird that they have memories connecting each of their lifetimes because it's going in sequential order, but now it's weird that he has something from being so old that relates with being so young. Which, I mean, technically, you could take anything. Like, I could take seeing an ant on the sidewalk now and relate it to back when I was three watching ants on the sidewalk. I mean, you could take anything and just relate it or whatever but um i think the next part should be the attic oh okay at first i thought they weren't here an attic in an apartment isn't it amazing i think this floor is otherwise reserved for heating and utility units for the building if something in the building explodes i guess it probably hit pretty close okay hope Okay, I'm trying- I'm starting to feel spooked about the memory leaping thing, but this isn't helping. Alright. Well, I guess we went out of order, but that's okay. Let's go back. My nose is itching right now. Um, and let's figure out this shit. What's going on next? Good thing we figured out this memento. I'm not very good at solving them. Oh my gosh, they go in so slow. Okay, sick. Okay, 
Cool. Off to the pepper airplane. Let us go back to the childhood. I want to see what she looks like young. There we are. Okay, so we're a little bit older. Slinged back again, huh? Yep, your theory still checks out. Okay, let's place pets. What? Bets on what's causing this anomaly, of course. Your guesses versus mine. A da. Oh, get a life. Dibs on first guess, then. Bet you ten dollars it's bad girl. Suddenly a romantic, aren't you? No, nah, just the fact that with these things it's always about some girl. Not everything is about some girl, Neil. Besides, I think we've seen enough from his own memories to say that he's happily married and... Hey! Huh? Oh, I got a sneeze from my nose itching. Achoo! Achoo! God bless America. Faye. What you doing up there? Just chilling? Yes, you! I see you standing there like that every day. What are you always looking at? Your book, girl. Uh, there you are. So, got a name? I feel like she's talking like a 30 year old adult. Um, you do have a name, right? Colin. What? I can't hear you. I said my name was Colin. Huh? You're Colin? What? What? No. Um, just let me just. Colin is now Kermit. Hold on. I'll be right back. Gotta take my little plushie with me. Okay, let's go inside. What are you doing? Oh, it's an airplane. Could have guessed that. Uh, doesn't seem like he's playing with it much. Poor Rue Dog. Hey, I'm gonna throw this paper plate over. I wrote stuff on it so you can catch it, okay? I was gonna say just speak louder, but... Okay. Okay, here it goes. And... No can do. Uh, hold on. Sick. Just buy a fucking drone. Duh. Who are you? Dumb kid has no respect for the laws of physics. He's like nine, dude. Okay, so I said he was nine before. Before he was like five. Hey, it's alright. You need to concentrate, okay? Keep your eyes on me and throw as hard as you can. If you try hard enough, I'm sure you can do it. I believe in you. Oh, how cute. How cute. Okay, okay, I can do this. Here it goes. Come on. Oh, shit. Bah! You should have seen your determined face. It's not funny. You can't throw it against the wind, silly, no matter how hard you try. 
What did you think was gonna happen? What? <laughs> I'm going inside. Okay, wait, wait, don't go. Why does she have tires on her thing? So, Colin, right? I thought you didn't hear me. Yeah, well, I think I've actually seen you on the way to school. What does that have to do with? You go to the one just across from the woods here, right? Yeah. Oh, well, I go to the one just across the street from yours. The private school? Yep, yep. Lucky. Why? Well, because it's all exclusive and costs money and stuff. Oh, hmm. I guess. People are all snobby there, though. They are? Nah, I'm just trying to make you feel better. Hey, let's walk to school together next time. Why? Because I like you, silly. You're the right... You're just the right amount of dumb. Wow, what a bitch. What's that supposed to mean? Besides, have you heard about the bear attacks in the woods? No, I've only seen badgers. What did you hear? Oh, no, I didn't hear anything either. But that's why I'm suspicious. It's a little too quiet. Anyway, we practically go the same route, right? It'd be good to stick together. I guess so. Uh-oh. Who are they? Is that her parents? What was that? Hmm. She just ran back in when they came out. Eh, it's not that uncommon for kids to be scared of their parents. Back when I was young, I knew a kid who had one scary mother. I saw her spanking him with a spatula once. First I thought that said tarantula. I don't know why. Uh, never ate her brownies after that. Note, Faye. Is that Sophia? Oh. Ooh. Someone's got a crush. The girl across the balcony. Oh. Again? Don't you dare do anything. I'm getting this one. Let me at least take it off the wall for you. No! Just don't. It's not even that high. We don't need to take it down. Okay. Aww. What a weirdo kid. He has a crush. Don't be mean to him. Oh, here he is. Oh, how cute. What are we watching? Today's classical guitar concert is sponsored by Meow Blend. Meow 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 meow. Why can't we have a jingle this catchy? One can only dream. Coming up next on Classics Replay, The Godfather. Hold on, I kind of want to stay and watch this. I don't think he's gonna remember everything that happened. Is he on the toilet? Why is he practicing on the bathroom? Because the bathroom reverb makes it sound awesome? Of course. Uh, you sure seem knowledgeable. <clears throat> Back when I played the triangle, I did it all the time. You would play the fucking triangle. Well, not very good. I feel like it'd be really hard to play. I'm not sure what would be harder, that or a guitar. Wow, not even the fabled bathroom reverb could save that crap. Alright, we got everything? Whoa, whoa. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button, that's why. LOL. I was like, why the hell is it going sideways? Okay. Alright, I am going to have to end the episode there. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked, please leave a like. And if you want to see more in the future, make sure you subscribe. I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.